Hi, this is Jennifer from Platinum Skin Care, and today I want to talk about chemical peels and which percentage you should be choosing. Okay, what percentage of acid should you choose? If you're a beginner, no matter what, always choose the lowest percentage possible. You don't know what to expect, you want to start slow and work your way up from there. No harm ever came from somebody applying too low of a percentage of appeal. You might not get visible flaking, you might not get the results that you were hoping for, but you're still going to get something. So starting low and working your way up, that's the only way. Now with the chemical peel, it is not a race to the top. Matter of fact, it is the absolute opposite. The turtle wins this race. You want to be slow and steady. Work your way up the steps of that ladder very, very slowly. Because when you reach the top, there's nowhere else to go. You can try another acid. You can, you know, pop on over, try a different acid, and that's fine. And that's what you're going to have to do. That's what people end up doing when, you know, they reach the top of glycolic. Oh, I'm going to try this acid. I'm going to try this one. Keep your skin guessing. That's how you're always going to get good results. But just basically start low, work your way to the top, and you're going to be happier and you're going to get better longer term results that way. The only exception to that rule is if you've been getting professional treatments. If you've been going to the dermatologist and you know that they're doing a 15% TCA on you at two layers and that works amazing for you, well absolutely. Go ahead and apply 15 TCA at two layers and get your same amazing results without the you know, the high fee of going to the office. That's perfectly fine. But if you're a newbie, you start at the low level and work your way up. I'm gonna tell you about the acids that we manufacture here and what percentages and which one you should start with and, you know, work your way up to, okay? So our first acid I wanna talk about is our glycolic acid. Glycolic is good for most people. It is a water-soluble acid, has a tiny molecule. It is the original lunchtime peel. This is the peel that started the whole craze where people really started catching on that you could go in, get just you know a 30 minute treatment, come out and your skin's just gonna look better for it in the end. That's what started this. People started realizing chemical peels are gonna change my life. And they are. So there's a few percentages here. We always want you to start at a 30%. 30% is great for most people. It has a nice pH level of 2.1, so you're gonna get a lot of action with less irritation than you could possibly get. Um, this is commonly used for fine lines, maybe some mild, mild photo damage or skin pigmentation, or also, you know, maybe a little bit of mild acne, um, but I think it's predominantly for anti-aging, light wrinkles, things of that nature. Start with your 30. The next step is a 50%. You're not going to want to move to a 50% until you've been using that 30% for quite a while and you feel like, yeah, I just need a little bit more. And that's okay. And most likely you're going to do a series of eight. And by the end of that series of eight, you can decide if 30 is not enough for you and you want to move up to the 50. If that's the case, go right ahead. The next percentage in our glycolic peels is 70. And that is not meant for your face full strength. Just stop right here. 70% is predominantly for your body. You can put 70% on straight on your body. Uh, arms, legs are common places, sometimes on the chest, but be careful with that area. It can be a little bit more sensitive. But the whole idea behind this higher percentage is because the skin on your body is much, much thicker than the skin on your face. So yeah, you can put a higher percentage on your body. The other use for our 70% is where you can custom dilute it to any percent you like. You can make a 10, a 15, 20, 25, all the way up to 65%. And that works well for many people that want to start off at one percentage and then gradually work their way up. That's a nice customizable peel that anybody can use as long as you're going to promise me that you don't put 70 on straight. Mm -hmm. 